This could be a crucial week in the battle to prevent another COVID surge. The FDA and CDC may approve Moderna and Johnson & Johnson booster shots for millions of Americans who want more protection from the virus. And we're expected to find out whether we'll be able to mix and match booster shots. Channel 3 Eyewitnesses reporter Aegel live in Wethersfield at a vaccine booster site with what you need to know this morning. Aya, good morning. Good morning, Wendell and Nicole, and this all comes less than a month after the FDA and CDC gave Pfizer the green light for booster shots. The CDC reports that less than 60% of U.S. Americans are fully vaccinated. This week, the FDA and CDC could sign off on Moderna and Johnson & Johnson vaccine boosters. I think it's critical that we prevent infection as much as we can. The agencies may allow Americans to get a different booster than what they originally received, specifically for the 15 million who got the Johnson & Johnson shot. Getting the same one is okay, and you will get enough protection to get you through Delta. But if you want a little bit more protection, mixing may have some benefit. Top health officials say families with fully vaccinated adults should be able to safely spend the holidays together this year. Connecticut's positivity rate is at 1.87%, according to the latest data from our state. More than 2.3 million people in Connecticut are fully vaccinated. And health officials hope the FDA will grant emergency approval for the COVID-19 vaccine for children ages 5 to 11 sometime next month. Reporting live in Wethersfield this morning, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.